Hi everyone, it's David Begno and this is Newsbreaker. It looks as though Israel may be getting ready to move ground troops into Gaza. Get a look at a photo we're getting in from a journalist at the Jerusalem Post. Uh, Israeli tanks on the back of trucks headed toward the Gaza border. Uh, journalist with the Huffington Post tweeting, Israel troops moving toward the Gaza border as Netanyahu warns that ground invasion is imminent if they cannot stop. For the last several hours, there have been rockets fired from Gaza toward Israel. In Tel Aviv, air sirens were going off. The first time that's happened since 1991. People hiding behind their cars, stopping on the roadway. Lots of pictures of children who have died. This beautiful little girl right here laying in a hospital bed. Uh, someone tweeted, this infant girl we met two hours ago in the ICU, she just died affected by her wounds. The death toll stands at about 12 right now. The number is fluctuating and changing by the minute. People posting uh, photos of the bomb shelter where they are taking cover every time the sign Sirens go off. Then we're getting this from a citizen journalist. Heaviest bombing so far, 10 plus explosions continuously. The ground shook, felt like an earthquake, blackout in North Gaza City. And we came across this tweet from Benjamin Netanyahu, the Israeli Prime Minister. Quote, I want to express my appreciation once again to President Obama for his unequivocal, clear sighted support for Israel's right to defend itself. But here's what's interesting. Moments after we came across that tweet, it seemed to be deleted. We're looking into that right now, but uh, if it was posted and then deleted, that might say something uh, in itself. So the Newsbreaker team is monitoring the story. We'll keep you posted. You can follow us on Twitter at Newsbreaker.